Large language models are designed to understand and generate text based on the instructions or prompts they receive. Prompting an LLM allows you to leverage the model's pre-trained language capabilities and control its outputs so that it can deliver what is relevant to your needs. The quality and relevance of the generated texts depend on the specific wording and context of the prompt. Prompts can be structured in various ways, and their effectiveness often depends on how well they convey the desired task or instruction to the model. In this video, let's take a look at the prompter, which is an agent system operator in Clarify, and serves as a pre-configured piece of text to instruct an LLM. Clarify is a full-stack AI platform that helps you quickly and collaboratively get vision, language, and audio AI into production. Now, what is an agent system operator? In Clarify, agent system operators are fixed function operators that act as non-trainable models. They help you connect, direct, and network your models in a workflow. These operators can be chained together with models to automate tasks. Here you can see different types of agent system operators, such as image cropper, regex-based classifier, object counter, SMS alert, etc. Prompter is one of them. There are different types of prompting techniques to improve control and relevance in generated outputs. Some of them include zero-shot prompting, few-shot prompting, text-specific prompt, etc. In this demo, let's look at zero-shot prompting. In zero-shot prompting, the model generates output or makes predictions without explicit examples or training. It simply requires providing a clear prompt for the LLM to generate relevant responses. The LLM is then able to use its pre-trained knowledge to complete the task. This technique is effective for straightforward problems, such as classification, text generation, and text transformation. Let's see how you can create a zero-shot prompter for a text classification task using the Workflow Builder. Workflows in Clarify allow you to combine multiple models and operators, performing various operations to build powerful multi-model systems for different use cases. Let's get started. First, sign up for Clarify. If you already have an account, log into the portal. Here is the community page you see when you first open the Clarify portal. Now, I am going to create a new application. Applications are the basic building blocks for creating projects on the Clarify platform. Your data, annotations, models, workflows, predictions, and searches are contained within applications. Simply add the app ID, a short description, and set the base workflow. I am creating the application with the name Prompter. Here is the app and you can see it's completely empty. You can see the inputs, data sets, models, workflows, and modules here. Let's go to Workflows and create a new workflow. I am changing the name of the workflow to Text Classification. Here on the left side, you can see different model types such as Audio Embedder, Audio to Text, Text to Text, etc. You can drag and drop any of these onto the canvas to connect and build multimodal applications. Now, for building a text classification workflow, we require an LLM and a prompter module. First, let's search for a prompter template option from the left sidebar. Here you can see the prompter. Drag and drop it onto the empty workspace. Similarly, search for the text-to-text -text model type and add it to the canvas. I am connecting the input to the prompter and the prompter to the text-to-text -text model type. In the prompter, you can see the data.text.raw field. When you input your text data at inference time, all occurrences of data.text.raw within this template will be replaced with the provided text. Now define the template text. Since we are creating a text classification example, I am using the following, label the sentiment towards the movie based on the given review. The sentiment label should be positive or negative. I am adding this template right before the data.text.raw field. Now, in the text-to-text -text model type, select an LLM from the Clarify community. Let's use GPT-4 here. I am searching for the model and selecting it. Since this is zero-shot prompting, we are not including any explicit examples in the prompt. We are just using GPT-4's pre-trained knowledge for text classification. Similarly, you can add different prompt templates. For example, few-shot prompting, 
where we provide a set of examples or small training data to guide the language model for the desired output. Let's look at the workflow once again. When you input the text data for text classification, in this case, a movie review, the input will be combined with the template text and passed to the GPT-4 model for sentiment classification. Now save the workflow. Let's run the predictions on this workflow. I am adding the text here, probably my all-time favorite movie, and clicking on Submit. You can see the response from the workflow here. You can even use this workflow via an API. Click on Use Workflow, and in the Call by API section, select your preferred language and copy the code. That's how you can use the prompter template with workflows in the Clarify platform. Thanks for watching.